A deadly shootout in the middle of a Chicago street. In the middle of the morning, a suspect allegedly pulls a gun on police who fired fatal shots. Good evening, everyone. I'm Jim Williams. My Martinez is off. It happened in the Woodlawn neighborhood. Police say they were chasing a suspected drug dealer. Let's go right to CBS 2. Suzanne Lemigno live from the police department's area central headquarters with more on this developing story. Suzanne. Jim, detectives here and the Independent Police Review Authority are now investigating this shooting. A massive police presence between Eberhardt and Rhodes on 63rd. Patrol cars, blue lights flashing after a police involved shooting. He got shot seven times on Rhodes right there by the police. Friends say 19 year old Rasan Shaw had just left them to get something to eat. He was running through the alley mm -hmm. with no gun or nothing because he just left us. So we know he ain't had no gun. The police shot him unjustified. Too many times in his back. He ain't do nothing, man. Chicago Fraternal Order of Police Lodge 7 spokesperson Pat Camden says Shaw was caught by police in the middle of a drug deal. They went after him. Camden says Shaw pointed a gun at police. The officer defends himself, shoots, shoots the offender. Uh, we did recover a 40 caliber Glock with an extended clip. Chaos erupts after the shooting. An angry mob gathers. The rumor starts to spread that he didn't have a gun. The police shot him for no reason. Nothing could be further from the truth. If you're carrying a gun and you're stopped by the police, put your hands up in the air and I guarantee you, you won't get shot. Point a gun at a policeman and I guarantee you, you will get shot. And that's what happened in this case. Absolutely. And police say that semi-automatic handgun recovered also had a laser sight on it. Live at Area Central, Suzanne Lemigno, CBS 2 News. Jim. Suzanne, thank you. 